Good morning. Yeah, it is a good morning. One of the things that is super obvious that I haven't mentioned is uh, maybe the most important teaching that I have received is that um, a good human life and good conduct, if you will, is It begins in gratitude and ends in gratitude. What a wonderful thing to be alive. What a wonderful thing to breathe. Yeah, breath is amazing and here we are just starting off grounding in the present moment, grounding in gratitude, in and out. Here we are. Yeah, so today's topic is uh, the ground of being. So gratitude is our attitude and uh, <laughs> nature is our ground of being. It's, uh, it's reality and nature is reality. Nature is us, we are nature. Um, yeah, we love the birds and the bees and the trees and the flowers and the sky. Yeah, and all the the creepy crawlies, they can be annoying, but they're they're part of our family. And um if you're watching this, you're deeply nature connected. You may not be nature knowledgeable or as knowledgeable as other people. There's always somebody who knows more about various parts of the natural world, names, cycles, etc., the science. Um, but I know your nature connected. And this is what brings us together in some ways, is that if we look deep enough and we know we are nature, uh, made from earth and stars, uh, we have a pretty strong bond that grows out of these beautiful hearts. Yeah. Yeah, so arguably nature connection is the, the prime cultural ingredient. Um, I think one of the points I'm trying to make here is that uh, we've been kind of brought up to see nature is out there. It's called the environment uh, and it's, it's pretty and it's beautiful and, and we, we go to it for solace and I just want to step it up and, uh, and uh, experience uh, in myself and bring it out in others that we're swimming. We are swimming in nature and it is beautiful. Just beautiful. Yeah, nature connection is a prime cultural ingredient for earth honoring culture. Uh, it is, uh, again, the ground of being. And it's beautiful to get together and explore the natural world and um, go into the micro, go into the macro together. And, you know, when you ask somebody to just, just, you know, a good, a, a good conversation with another person, uh, if you're willing to really listen, is to just say, hey, what's a... What's a beautiful, deep uh, experience you've had with the natural world? And I want to just listen to that and 
it's amazing and, and so beautiful that what comes out of people's hearts and minds when you ask them that super, super simple question. So yeah, it's, uh, it's our bond. And you know, that ginkgo behind me and this beautiful land that I'm so fortunate to caretake is, uh, it's the, it, it, it's the place where, uh, it's, uh, it's kind of my, my launching pad, um, from my heart to yours to, um, to make the intention to con connect ever more deeply with what's all around us all the time. Thanks for listening.